Hello and welcome to this small video which will give you a complete grounding in WordPress. So if you haven't used WordPress before or even if you have and you know your way around, you will find great information coming up on creating a successful website and building an online presence. You'll learn about posts and pages, the thousands of different plugins, widgets and themes available, a couple we highly recommend and use ourselves, as well as techniques used by big companies online. Did you know that absolutely anyone can use WordPress and some of the biggest companies and most famous celebrities use it as an effective and easy way to sell their products, share their work, their thoughts and broaden their market? Because WordPress really is easy. I promise. I remember when I first heard about WordPress, I was excited at the thought of being able to build my own website with absolutely no programming at all, and it would cost me less than having lunch out. I was also intimidated because it was something I had never done, but I quickly realised it was actually easy and straightforward. So follow along with me and find out why you're in good company if you use WordPress to publish on the web. Many famous blogs, news outlets, music sites, Fortune 500 companies and celebrities are using WordPress, such as CNN, Katy Perry, The New York Times, Forbes and Jay-Z. This video isn't long enough to list them all, so let's go. In this beginner's guide to WordPress, I want to introduce you to the basics of WordPress, what you need to know in order to start building your own successful WordPress website you'll be amazed at how simple it really is. And when you want to learn even more, we have everything you need over on our website. So let's start with the two main things you need in order to have a WordPress website. They are a domain name and hosting. The domain name is your WordPress address. It's what people type in to visit your website. So ours is websitesmadeeasy.tv. Hosting is just like renting physical space, which keeps all your data, images and everything to do with your website on. We have been using HostGator for years. They have a brilliant 24-7 customer service, an uptime guarantee, unlimited bandwidth and unlimited space. They are very affordable as well. It's a win-win. All you would do is head to HostGator, choose your domain name, choose your hosting, enter a coupon code we give you to reduce the cost even further and you're ready to go. We've made a quick video guiding you through the process, which you can click on after this video. Once you have your website, give yourself a pat on the back because this is a great achievement. You've accomplished in just a few minutes what used to take hours or days, so well done. You'll now be able to log into your website and begin customizing it. On the left, you've got the main sidebar, which has tabs such as posts, pages, appearance, themes, plugins and settings. When you add plugins, they may have their own tabs like I do here such as SEO, Sumo Me and WP Socializer. The SEO plugin by Yoast is a complete game changer. If you use SEO effectively, you can get your website highly ranked in the search results such as in Google. Sumo Me List Builder is how I manage to double my email opt-ins. It really is an exciting plugin if you want to build a fan base of thousands of subscribers. This simple plugin has a pop-up that triggers when a visitor is about to leave. And WP Socializer adds social icons to your posts and pages. As I said, all of these are covered in videos on our website. WordPress plugins are extremely exciting. They are extra bits of functionality that can be added to your website to extend and expand your WordPress site. This is one of the primary advantages of using WordPress. Plugins can add anything to your website, from contact forms, maps, photo galleries, to more advanced techniques such as lead magnets to gain thousands of subscribers and really start building your online presence. Plugins are a game changer, as I said, but they need to be set up properly. So we've made a great video for you that is all about the best plugins to use and a step-by-step -step guide to properly setting them up. When you installed WordPress, it came activated with a default appearance or theme. A theme is how your website looks and functions, and you can choose from tens of thousands of themes to use, and they are all free. Just go to Appearance and Themes to have a look around. You can browse popular themes or type in the search if you know a theme's name. WordPress themes are also responsive, which means your website will look great whether someone visits from their phone, tablet, or desktop. 
your website will automatically be made smaller for phones and larger for desktops, so it always looks its best. You can also customize your website using widgets. A WordPress widget is a small block on your website that performs a specific function. For example, a contact form, which allows visitors to send you a message or to subscribe. You can add widgets pretty much anywhere on your website, in areas called widget ready areas. It also depends on the widget you're trying to use and also the theme you're using. WordPress widgets were originally created to provide a simple and easy to use way of giving design and structure control of the WordPress theme. Some plugins come with their own widgets, so it's worth checking out the widget section if you install a new plugin. If you're new to WordPress, you may be wondering what the difference is between a post and a page. Put simply, if you're going to be using WordPress for a blog, then you'll be using posts a lot to post content onto your website. Pages, however, are meant to be a static, one-off type content such as your homepage, about page or contact page. To create either is simple and straightforward. You just go to post or page and add new. Having posts or pages on your website allows you to add images, videos, as well as use widgets and plugins for more functionality. For example, to add social media icons so visitors can share your content. In the settings section, you have some options to set your website title and tagline. You've got the option to let visitors register if you have that set up, edit your time zone and date time format, and your site's language. One important thing to remember is to not be tempted to change your WordPress address here or site address here. When I first started, I thought I could change my address like this, but you can't. It made things very complicated to fix afterwards, so don't change those. If you do want to change your website address, you need to contact your hosting service and they will guide you through the process. You also have settings for reading and writing, such as how you want your front page to display, either as a static page, which you would generally use for a website, or your latest posts, which you would use for a blog. And this updates every time you add a new post, and it will have your latest post at the top, so your fresh content can be seen easily by visitors. In reality, anyone can start using WordPress in a very short space of time. The key is to focus on the absolute basics and work your way up to learning more advanced things when the time is right. People tend to jump in at the deep end and try to create custom designed, plugin and widget heavy blogs with all the bells and whistles and quickly become overwhelmed, not knowing how to properly use it all to its full potential or not setting it up correctly. It's great to use plugins and widgets, of course, but make sure you know how to use them correctly. If you think this is a good fit for you, then we have lots more step-by-step -step videos all about WordPress over on our website, which guides you through to building a successful website and online presence. I'll guide you every step of the way, explaining everything so you learn exactly what certain things do, and you can go from beginner to experienced WordPress user in no time. Learn how to go from a few subscribers a week to thousands using techniques that big companies use on their own websites. Learn quick and easy ways to set up a beautiful looking website. Discover how to use SEO to reach millions of fans and land your website at the top of search results in Google. I hope you have enjoyed this video and it has given you an idea of how powerful WordPress can be for you and also how easy it is to work with, especially with our videos guiding you through step by step. If you did, please give it a quick like if you want to be notified as soon as we upload a new video, then subscribe, and if you can, please share it. Thank you, and see you in the next video.